2006, paper 1, question 1. Remember, we can get these values from our calculator. So the sine of 0 is 0. The sine of 90 is 1. The sine of 180 is 0. The sine of 270 is minus 1. And the sine of 360 is 0. And I know a sine curve is a wave. So if I join those up. Sine of x minus 1, let's take 1 away from all of the y values we got on our previous one. So the sine of 0 take away 1 is minus 1. Sine of 90 take away 1 is 0. 180 take away 1 is minus 1. 270 minus 2 and then 360 will be minus 1. And again if we join those up, the sine curve.